All right, so today I'm going to cover how to scan to network folders uh, on your Sharp MFP copier printer scanner. Uh, first step is to create yourself a folder where you'd like to scan. Uh, the easiest place to do this is on the C drive. Just create a new folder. I'm going to call this one Scanned Documents. Okay, and then once that folder is there, right click on it, go to Properties move to the sharing tab and click share uh, now you can add specific users here or you can just add everyone click add and then you want to change the permission level to read and write and click share this is your folder path that you're going to need later uh, if you'd like to double click on that and then you can copy the path from here that's the share path for the folder. Okay, and then what I like to do as well uh, is just make a shortcut. Uh, right click, go to send to desktop, create shortcut. That will put the folder right on the desktop for you. The next step is to open the copier's web page. You can do that by typing the IP address into a web browser. Click address book on the left menu. Click Add. Uh, the address name here is what the button on the screen will say on the touch screen of the copier. So I'll just call this Colin Scans. We want to change the type here to Network Folder. And then we'll fill out this bottom area here. The Network Folder path is what we copied earlier. So we'll just paste that in. Then this username is what you want to use uh, any user that has rights to that folder that you just created and shared so for me I'm just going to use the administrator and then the most important step here is to scroll down and check this set as default used box you don't check that it's not going to work properly and then click submit so now if we check the address book we'll see that our folder is in here. Everything is lined up correctly so when we scan something it should go directly into the folder we created. Here on the desktop is our shortcut. So when you scan it just drop right here. And that's all there is to it. Uh, there should be some more helpful links below. If this was helpful for you please click the like button. Uh, subscribe. I put out these how-to's every so often. Uh, it will be much appreciated.